love to see this body. And we are going to be plugging right along <clears throat> with fractions, adding and subtracting fractions um, that are mixed in numbers. Now, this has nothing to do with regrouping. Regrouping will be a whole new lesson so that you can take each part in as it is. First thing we still have to do is what we did like yesterday, get a common denominator. So we can count by twos and land on a four, then we want to use that. So we're going to use a four. This did not change. It's like multiplying by one. This we went by two, new top. We are adding. So we add the numerators. The two and the one make three fourths. And then we can't forget this big front number. So five, six, seven. That's our new fraction. It does not need to be simplified because it already is looking at this next one. Five, 10, four, eight, 12, 5, 10, 15, 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 5, 10, 15, 20. They meet at 20. You can times by 4, numerator and denominator, new top, new top. And it's subtraction. So 12 take away 5 is 7. 20 is our denominator. 8 minus 4 is 4. This does not need to be simplified because 7 is prime. This is composite. This has many factors, but 7 is not one of them. So, so far, we haven't had to simplify. If this was 8 20ths, we'd have to simplify it. Common denominator here, 8, 16, 24, 32, 40. Looks like 40. We count by fives, we can land on 40. We need to multiply by 5, multiply its numerator by 5, we get 35. 5 goes to 40 by 8. 4 times 8 is 32. We are adding this, 32 and 35, 67 40ths, 12 plus 7, 19. We cannot leave this. This is top heavy. We have to fix this. So making, remembering how to do this, you ask yourselves, how many 40s go into 67? That it goes in one time with 27 left over, over 40. And then we have to take both of our whole numbers, this one we just created, and that 19, and put them together. So 19 and 1 make 20, and 27 40ths. We think, can this be simplified? 27 has a 9 and a 3. Neither can work for 40. 27 has a 1 and a 27. Nothing works for 40. So we have our simplified fraction. And as always, this is Mrs. Bobby. And I love math. And cross it. Best workout in the world.